third biennial Haiti Film Festival this week. Opening night is this Thursday at Drome in the East Village and will scre feature screenings of short films along with live music and dancing. This festival runs through May 15th. Regine M. Romain is the founder and executive director of the Haiti Cultural Exchange. Welcome. Thank you. It's Thank so you nice so to see you. Thanks me. for coming. We're I really appreciate very it. Very excited about this. I had not heard of this festival before. And uh, I mean, who knew? I mean, there's all these great filmmakers that are coming out of Haiti. So this began in 2009. Correct. The organization was founded in 2009. Okay. The Film Fest launched in 2011, and it's oh, a biennial it's film a, festival. So it's every two years. That's correct. Um, and you're starting it off, kicking off this year. What made you want to start this festival in the first place? So Haiti Cultural Exchange was founded to present a varied view, a more nuanced view of Haiti, and to celebrate our arts and culture. Okay. Um, we're often put inside of a box, a stereotypical box of poverty, of need, of disaster. And we have so much more to offer than that. The arts, our culture, our musicians, our filmmakers. And so Haiti Film Fest was born out of that. Because through film, you can tell lots of stories. Uh, you can get a more complete picture of things. You can, uh, you can provide education for people through documentaries and feature films. And so the film festival was born out of that kind of desire to tell our stories ourselves. What, you know, you, you mentioned the stereotypical things that people know Haiti for. Of course, the earthquake was one of the big things, the disastrous earthquake that people there are still trying to recover from. Um, and you mentioned poverty and things like that. And yet, there's so much more to a place. When we sort of put things in a small box in television and people see one small thing, um, you mentioned, you also said it opens as a dialogue what is the dialogue that you're trying to get across? So the filmmakers are all, a lot of the filmmakers are going to be present, in particular for the Haiti Film Fest will be present and have an opportunity to talk about their film, to talk about their process, and to talk about the issues that we, um, we delve into with these various films. Um, there's a film on the issue of recycling and garbage happening in Haiti, and it's a student film. It's a graduate student um, from the Cine Institute, which is Haiti's only free film school. And we have many student films that we're screening throughout the festival, which is a great thing as well yeah. to provide that opportunity. And you're encouraging, of course, students to participate in Absolutely, this. absolutely. It's bigger and better than mm -hmm. ever this year. You've extended it from three days to seven days. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that takes on a whole other level of challenges. Do you think it will ever become an annual event versus biennial? I don't think so. I think there aren't maybe that many films that are being made about Haiti mm -hmm. um, by Haitian filmmakers. I mean, you never know, but I think for now, uh, the number of films that we're seeing, the quality of films that we're seeing, I think biennial is great. But we have expanded to a whole week, yes. and uh, we're going to be in multiple venues throughout the city. Let's talk about those venues. Yes. You'll be several places in Manhattan and Brooklyn, Yeah. Correct? So opening night is at Drome on May 7th, which is this Thursday, and it's a fundraiser for the festival. The festival, the rest of the festival is free for people to attend or suggest a donation. No tickets required. People show up. They give their suggested donation. First come, first serve, and they get to come. Ah, okay, so great. opening night is a fundraiser, um, and that's Thursday at, at Drome. And then the rest of the films are screening in multiple venues. So Brooklyn Public Library, mm -hmm. Brooklyn Historical Society, City College, Maisel's. Um, I'm missing stuff. But, people, yeah. is, there, is there a website that people can go to Absolutely. to find out that information? Yeah, so it's uh, www.haiticulturalx.org okay. is the website. Okay. And people can find out all about the film festival. The schedule of screenings is all up on our website. We're also on social media at Haiti Cultural X, so folks can follow us there. Fantastic. Well, I hope you have a huge turnout, Regine. Thank you so much. Thanks I so really much for coming, it. and congratulations on the bigger and better Thank Haiti you. Film Festival. All right, Gus will be right back.